to the ground, we've got a better read on it and can give you better lead time. And that's why a lot of the warnings are issued now based on radar-indicated tornadoes as opposed to a tornado sighted by a law enforcement officer or a spotter on the ground. So, I'm Storm Team 2 Chief Meteorologist Rob Fowler. We're watching the weather very closely here on the Storm Team 2 forecast. Again, this tornado warning until 345. Brand new severe thunderstorm warnings for portions of Berkeley and Dorchester counties will continue to break in. And you can also follow right at the bottom of your screen the latest information right here on News 2. Thanks for joining us, and we'll be here if you need us uh, in the Storm Team 2 Forecast Center. Well, warning in addition is in effect, so this is. A I knew they were going to issue it. We feel has the possibility, Jesus. capability of producing a tornado. And right now, as we zoom in, we'll kind of give you a better look at exactly, give you the that's bearings. Crazy. And again, you see that's Hollyville. We're in the Harleyville, tornado warning. Four holes, Holly Hill. That's also in Orangeburg County. Wetzel. Right now is where it looks like the circulation is most prominent at this particular time on Storm Team 2 okay, Titan no, HD. No, so, again, we encourage you no to, to uh, take cover if you're in that we area. Gotta take if cover you're downstream now. from this, just be weather aware. Uh, you may I'll need to get the into the interior portion of your home. Again, we have no confirmed tornadoes at this particular but time. But as we mentioned cloud, a few moments ago, this is what source. Doppler radar does, and this is why it's so tremendous. What a great tool it is, is we can actually look inside the storm and possibly see a rotation up in the storm before it comes down to the ground, if it comes down to the ground. Right now, uh, we understand that the circulation is approaching Duncan Chapel at this time. This is that circulation within the storm are very near the I-95, I-26 intersection. So uh, that's exactly where we are right now on Storm Team 2 Titan HD. So generally in this uh, area that I'm kind of circling right now, this appears to be the area where we're going to I'm getting the scanner. Turn one for Dorchester County. Kind of a better look at what's going on with this. In addition to the warning that was already up for uh, Char for Orangeburg County. And you can see the warning, it's cordoned off by the red right here. Again, it does extend all the way down to the south of the east of Harleyville. Yeah. And kind of borders into St. George where we have that. The hook echo. That means there's strong rotation now. Again, at this particular time, we would encourage you to be aware. We have not had any confirmed tornadoes on the ground at this particular time. You got to take cover. Large day is certainly a real possibility in this area. And a possibility of a tornado as well. Oh my God! Storm Team 2 Titan HD as well. We are taking. We are monitoring the severe storm capable of producing a tornado seven miles north of Indian Field, moving southeast at 15 miles an hour. This storm will move roughly along Interstate 26. Some locations in the warning include Indian Field, Hollyville, Duncan Chapel. This is a dangerous supercell thunderstorm. Reducing our tail and damaging straight lines. How large? Baseballs. So we notice there's a large. I live in Harleyville, so that storm's coming my way. Small area of a bright green and a bright red right next to the warning for Dorchester County at 415. We're not seeing anything that's jumping out of us. Maybe some brighter colors right around here. And Bill, I don't know if you can look at go. It's a tornado on the ground now. We gotta get. I'm going to warm my people up there in Speedsville. Yeah, so not very fast at all. 
and oh minus one degree. God. So yeah, yeah. The, so. It looks like it's, it's not a huge, it's not a major couplet right there as far Thank as wind God. shear. Right. In fact, that we can pull up the shear value. It could be that yeah. straight to straight know, line winds. That's, that's what causes all the damage. Anderson, that was two days ago. This same storm system that uh, pushed through Oklahoma. Obviously, it's much weaker now. But yeah, but yet I'm seeing tornadoes where I live. Because this thunderstorm is all by itself, which just means it has all that potential energy going into it. And when you get a large circulating storm like Pacific. Now we're under tornado one until 415. We're going to turn on the weather channel. I hear you. Tornado warning for gift card. Man, I got to have of this. Get the latest smartphones on AT&T's 4G LTE. All right. 10 mile an hour winds. We got it's till 4 o'clock. I like we saw up like in 32 Anderson. minutes. Yeah, Bill, this is actually moving uh, not as slow as some of the other storms around it. This one's moving to the southeast at 15. So it's not tremendously fast, but it's faster than a lot of the uh, slow bubbling up storms that we have seen. So again, if you live in Upper Dorchester County, right along 20, we got to take cover. You make your way into uh, upper and western sections of Berkeley County. Come on, on the lookout here. This is where the possible. I'm gonna warn my people. Right I'm gonna go on Facebook and warn them. Jet so warning for Dorchester County at 4:15. I'm gonna warn. In the immediate Charleston area, you can see what we've got going on. We've got storms getting closer storms to me. To I just read what well. the weather service said. The continuing like indicator of severe thunderstorm or strong we've rotation. Popped up it's up getting closer to Rosenville. I better again, take cover here in Harleyville. To see a tornado warning for portions of Berkeley and uh, Dorchester. Good three. And uh, here's Harleyville. So if you are in Harleyville, definitely take that. So that, that we gotta take place, cover right uh, now. As we speak, down as you make the way right to, now uh, between Harleyville and really all the way back up toward uh, uh, Rosenville, we're looking at uh, some right now, Mom. We gotta take cover.